The Dyspraxia Foundation is a countrywide charity committed to raising awareness of dyspraxia and to increasing understanding of how those who have the condition can be supported positively and successfully. It depends entirely on voluntary donations and membership subscriptions. Each year we run a week-long national awareness campaign. Dyspraxia Awareness Week 2014 was held from the 12th to the 18th of October and has seen our first Funky Friday event. The week started with a drinks reception at the Houses of Parliament, organised by our staunch supporter MP Emma Lowell Buck and was generously sponsored by Norton Rose Fulbright. This enabled us to highlight issues faced by young people with dyspraxia to key members of Parliament and to grasp the publicity opportunities that this generated. A special mention must go to our VIP guests Marilyn Owen and Stella White who founded the charity in 1987 and who were delighted to witness that the charity remains active and in safe hands. In a recent survey by the Dyspraxia Foundation, hundreds of young people admitted to living with high levels of anxiety, isolation and fear and are particularly vulnerable to bullying. Therefore, we decided to focus on teenagers during the event. We ran a Nominator Star competition and staff, volunteers and our supporters blogged wrote articles, held sponsored events and shared dyspraxia related news on social media. The week culminated with a hugely successful Funky Friday event which captured the imagination of many of our supporters in the UK and abroad. The Dyspraxia Foundation is so very grateful for the support and publicity, the hard work of its small staff, volunteers and to all those who took time to participate to raise much needed funds and boost awareness. Join us on Facebook and Twitter and visit our website to read about all we achieved during one short week and to keep up to date with our current events and activities. We do have so much more to do and we urge you to become a member of the charity to enable us to keep moving forward and bring dyspraxia to the attention of everyone in our society.